What's special about the Rodale Institute is that we are the birthplace of the organic movement. We not only are a farm, but we conduct research here at our institute. You as a farmer have the ability to be an activist. By taking care of the soil and doing it organically, that is your first way to preserve the integrity of the soil and create healthy food, which in turn will create healthy people. We've sort of been blowing people's minds by having hemp at the farm. This is the first time hemp has been grown here legally for almost 80 years. We have a huge hemp history in Pennsylvania. We know that hemp grows well here, so we want to take some of that risk away from farmers by doing some of that initial research so that when they are able to grow their crop, they're set up for success. Hemp has been a tool to just get people more excited in our research and what some of the potential is for organic agriculture and soil health. As tall as this crop is, it has a very robust root structure. And in, in, in that root structure, it actually gives us uh, biomass and it gives us uh, organic matter that's gonna stay in the soil and help improve it over time. We have a surplus of carbon dioxide, so growing more green plants that are lush like this, that can pull more of that carbon out of the atmosphere and return some of it to the soil, uh, we're gonna help at least reduce the amount of carbon in the atmosphere. We are trying to see if hemp can be a cover crop that closes the gap between one crop and another and manages weeds effectively. So that's what I'm hoping to, that, we, that this research is gonna establish, that here we have a cover crop that is not only controlling weeds, but also is a cash crop. So by having hemp, you're not, the growers are not only making money, they're controlling their weeds, but they are also contributing to a mitigation of environmental impacts. When you see a field covered in bees, you know you have a healthy product. Our focus is looking at how this crop can be used. In terms of the way it covers the soil, it is comparable to any other cover crop that you would use. I would say the only exception is that it's of higher value than most of those crops. What we're doing is actually leaving the planet in better shape than we found it. Mm -hmm.